What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Liquid Crystal walkthrough. Okay, so we defeated our girlfriend Sabrina for our 10th badge, and now it is time for us to go to Celadon City. Uh, we were thinking about going to Cerulean City, but that is something that we're going to probably have to take care of like later, later on. So let's go right ahead and just take care of it. And before we leave, homie here is going to stop us. It's like, good work back there, Draven. We show Team Saturn. I think, I think put together we can destroy them. Well, I'm off to, uh, to see more of Kanto. Nobody can get through the, uh, to below Fuchsia City anyway. Apparently it's blocked off by some huge rocks. Well, I'll see you around. Well, that right there is that. So, let's go right ahead and go straight to, to Cerulean City and, or Celadon City and, wow, this is, uh, new. This is, uh, brand new right here. This is big. Um, okay, alright, this is big, brand new, and I was kind of, okay, so that, that, that okay, so this right here, underground path has been closed forever, Cerulean City P Police, okay, so there has been some issues around there, and let's see what kind of Pokemon you can find right here. Okay, Spearows, Meowth, uh, Raticate, Meowth, uh, and Growlithe. I was kind of hoping to find a Houndour right here, but I don't... I think it's like super rare or something. I don't even know. Let's see, Meowtha. Come on. Well, we haven't caught a Spearow yet, so... Let's go right ahead. Now, you guys are... For those who are new and you guys are seeing that I have two Master Balls, no, I did not cheat to get them. I was... You get two. Could be wrong, you could get three. First one from Professor Elm after beating the eight badges. And the next one from the the president of Silco after defeating Team Saturn and all that stuff, so that is where I got them. And I'm gonna name this guy Oh wait, 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 was it Hurricane or No, it's Tornado. Shit, my bad. Okay, so here we go. Tornado. Tornado the we got Tornado. Okay, so welcome back, Tornado. Now I'm gonna try and find Hira right here. And nothing. Okay, so I don't think you can find Hira. But we'll find out. We'll eventually find out. So let's go right here. They, they added quite a few things right here, like a little more space. And here we are in Celadon City, guys. And, uh, well... We're gonna take a small tour, and we're gonna be battling some Pokemon trainers along the way. And, well, it looks like to me, there's nothing up here. Except just a tree, so let's go right ahead and see if we still get another Pokemon right here. Could be wrong. I don't even know. So let's see, let's see, let's see. Going right here. And if you talk to this guy, let me recount a terrifying tale. Once upon a time, there was a little boy who was given a new bike. He wanted to try it right away. He was giving so much fun, or he was having so much fun that he didn't notice that the sun had set. While riding home in pitch black, the bike suddenly slowed. Pedals became heavy. When, when he stopped pedaling, the bike began slipping backwards. It was as if the bike had it were cursed, and I'm trying to drag him to oblivion. Shriek. The boy had been riding uphill on still the, the, the cycling road. Wow. But dumb bump. For that, he's going to give us the TMO3. What would that be? Let's see. TMO3 is curse. Okay, so that right there is a... Uh, Okay, so that right there is a... that's kind of a... Yeah, that right there was kind of anticlimactic. I am going to move on right here and, uh, let's see... We do need the cut technique, so we're gonna have to, like, replace a Pokémon. Alright, so, let's see, here we are. Uh, let's see, talk to this guy, hide out in the basement corner. Oh wait, that was three years ago. You seen? okay, I'm back visiting my hometown, it's been quite a while. Okay, so you seen's right there. And, well, she's telling me about Erica. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm actually going to be switching up my uh, team. Let's see. What do I have? Uh, let's see. Well, I didn't use Shroom Lee yet, just yet. Let's see. Does it have cut? Okay, so we're going to have to replace Shroom Lee for the time being with somebody who has cut. Place that right there. Let's see. Summary. What up, Orchid? And that... Okay, she doesn't have 
cut technique right there. So let's see. Um, who in the bloody muddy lover should learn a cut? Should be somebody that I kind of don't need for the time being. Uh, I could go with the. Uh, yeah, you know what? Let's go with Cyrus. All right, Cyrus, get in there. Alrighty. Okay, so let's go right ahead. And let's go ahead and use that cut right up here. And let's teach it to Cyrus. And wow, everybody in everybody on this team can learn uh can actually learn the move. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take away Screech Attack. And since we're we're going up against a grass type trainer, I probably should replace another Pokemon right here. So let's go right ahead and get ourselves Buckus and replace a good old buddy Claymore right here. And there we go. Okay, so here we are in Celadon City. And well this is home to the whatchamacallit, the uh, the whatchamacallit place, and uh, if you talk to right here, hey champ in the making, are you playing in the slots too? I'm trying to get enough slots for a prize Pokemon, but I don't have enough uh, coins yet, and let's see, hey, underneath the poster, there's nothing. Underneath that, there's nothing. It would be it would be funny if, like, you can actually find something. Now, let's see, uh, I do have quite a few coins. Yeah, let's see, what kind of Pokemon would they sell right here? Exchange of choice, uh, next door. Okay, so that's exactly what we're going to be doing right here. We're going to be going to the next door. And, well, let's see. What kind of Pokemon? Okay, so we got items right here. Pretty good items, like Mystic Water, Charcoal, Miracle Seed. Th those are good ones. And then, uh, what kind of Pokemon would you give me? Oh, wow. So you were able to get yourself a Pikachu, Porygon, and Larvitar. So, oh, God, I'm stretching right now. Oh, God. You know what Pokemon I want to get? Pikachu. All right, so we got ourselves a Pikachu. Let's nickname this guy. Okay, so it's a male Pikachu. Of course, we gotta name him. We gotta name him Sparky. If it was a female Pikachu, then yes, it would be named Aaliyah. So here we go. What's up, Sparky? Welcome back to the team. And that Pikachu will be transferred to the PC. I got 39. Eh, well, I can wait for later on right here. So let's see. Calm and cool. Don't lose my money. Okay. Let's see. Uh, there's nothing else. Rainbow of Dreams, and let's go ahead and surf right here. I'm assuming the guy's going to tell us about the Grimer that came up. Let's see. Grimer have been appearing lately. Grimer live now. Okay, so that's a serious problem. Now, something that I learned in Pokemon Sun and Moon is that the Grimer over... The Alolan Grimer actually are are beneficial to their, uh, to their waters. They actually clean up the waters, which is pretty cool. And... Let's see. Well, I, well, let's go ahead and visit the. Uh, let's go ahead and visit the Celadon department. Let's see. Service counter, trainer's market, TV shop, wise man gifts, drugstore, and vending machines. Okay, so let's see if they actually sell any kind of TMs right here. Let's see. Talk to this guy. Oh yeah, he does sell TMs. Hyper beam, dig, mud slap, detect, attract. Wow, not so many. Not so many good, uh, yeah, good TMs right here. So let's move on right here. Uh, let's see. I think we're gonna go to the we're gonna go to the vending machines right here because I I kind of have a feeling that they might sell something there. All right. So let's see. Talk to this guy. Roulette. No. Let's see. Well, if you talk to this, stop moving. There's no games I wanted to play. Oh wow. Okay. So vending machine. Okay. Got myself a fresh water. Not really. Okay, so there's nothing of importance right here. I could be missing something, but the deal is that I kind of want to get my next badge. So let's go right down and destroy everybody in the next gym. Alrighty, okay, so let's see. Is the gym still located in the same spot? Yes, it is. And uh, let's see. Talk to this guy. They're holding an eating contest at the restaurant. Eating contest? Okay! If you guys may remember, in my old Pokemon, or not old, but uh, my mo my most recent Pokemon Black walkthrough episode, I did talk about tacos, taco eating contest, and how my friend sharded on his girlfriend's carpet. That is funny. 
And, well, let's see. I wonder if these guys give me something. Food is good. Okay. And Crunch Crunch. Nobody can give me a coin kiss. You should look in Johto. Let's see. Gulp Gulp. Quantity quality. And don't talk to me. Okay, cool. They want to be the next Kobayashi. But, unfortunately for me, I can't eat. We don't eat right here. Okay, so let's move on right here. And let's go right ahead and talk to the old perverted guy, Master Roshi. <laughs> this gym is great. Only girls are allowed here. Yep, he is definitely Master Roshi. Okay, so here we are in the Celadon City gym. And we're going to be battling people. And, well, double battles are right there. Okay, so this is a double battle right here. Ice punch onto you. And there we go. That's one. Aromatherapy doesn't do much. There we go. Ice punch. There we go. Suck on those berries. Look at that. Okay, so that was a good victory for us. Okay, so this place might look like a double uh, double team or well, double battle kind of thing. So we're going to be switching out to the... Actually, what the hell did I do? Let's go with Cinder. And good old Buckus. That's right. Buckus. Let's go. Buckus. Right here, a battle, and oh, it's a one-on-one -on -one battle. Okay, so let's go with Executor. Flame Wheel for the win. Oh, crud. Flame Wheel. Crap. Okay, so here we go. Hyper Potion. You're making me work for it. Stop hurting me. I'm confused. Crap baskets. Okay, so let's go right ahead and use a full restore because we got it. There we go. Everything's healed. Time to die. Confusion. God dang it, how do we get confused so many goddamn times? Here we go. Nearly beats him. Come on. Oh, damn you! Revenge! Flamethrower. Okay. That was annoying right there. Okay. Overheat. Doesn't really matter. How do you have an how do you have an Arbok on your team? Alright, let's go to Latios. Luster Purge, eat that. Vile Plume, let's go back to Budkiss, because he's now recovered, and time to eat this flamethrower. Look at that, okay, so... That right there was annoying. So, let's go back to the revives right here. Cinder, how could you lose to that Pokemon? I wanna know. Alright, and then what else, what else, what else, what else, what else, what else, what else? We need a full restore. This guy right here. Okay, so let's move on. We got one more trainer. And yes, I was looking at you. So let's go ahead and take on Julia. And go with the flame wheel. There we go. Execute. Go. Let's do this again. Flame wheel. That's right. Another one. Get this flame wheel. Time to take it down and look at that level 55. And level 44. That's awesome. That's great. That's good. Okay, so Beauty Julia was defeated, and he, she's like, how annoying. Okay, so let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here. Let's go with Buckus and see, see how this is going to work right now. Okay. Hello. Lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant. I'm afraid I may doze off. My name is Erica. I am the leader of the Celadon Gym. Oh, all the way from Johto, you say? Oh, nice. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't realize that you wished to challenge me. Very well, but I shall not lose. Okay, let's do this. Gym battle number 11. Erica, our girlfriend, Erica. She's very, 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 very polite. Very, she's, she's, she's very fancy, fancy. Let's go, flamethrower attack for the win. There we go. Oh, yes. Flamethrower does it. Okay, okay. Look at that. Alrighty. Shellgon's growing levels, and she's coming out with a Tangela, so... Let's do it again. Flamethrower again. Alrighty. Look at that. Tangela defeated. Eat it. Okay, alrighty, alrighty. And let's see, what else is next? Oh, she's coming out with the Vile Plume, so we're gonna finish it off with a very, 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 very special move right here. Overheat. Time to eat this. Overheat. 
for the win. Suck on those lemons. Oh, yeah. Look at that. She had no chance. Nothing. None. Fatality. And, well, look at that. Book is gross to level 58. Untouched, unscathed, unnothing. And Shelgon, level 45. And look at that. Erica has been defeated. And she's like, oh, I can see defeat. You are remarkably strong. I shall give you the rainbow badge. Yeah, buddy. Okay, look at that. Throwing out the peace sign. I got the rainbow badge. Yeah, buddy. Okay. That was a delightful match. I felt inspired. Please, I wish you to have this TM. It's, it is Giga Drain. It is a wonderful move that drains half the damage it inflicts to heal your Pokemon. Please use it if it pleases you. Alrighty. So look at that. TM19. Giga Drain. And she's like, losing leaves a bitter aftertaste, but knowing that there is a strong trainer spurs me to do better. Okay, alrighty. So, okay, so that's pretty much it right there. Okay, so that's, uh, what, 11 badges total. And... I don't, I kind of feel like it's not the end of the whole, the whole thing right here. I kind of feel like there's something else going to go on. And, well, that's probably what we're going to have to do in the next episode. Let's see. What's going on right here? If there's anything, yes, yeah, somebody's waiting for, oh, wow, this guy right here. <laughs> I finally got up to you, Draven. I saw you get off Vermilion City, so I trailed you. I've been training my Pokemon here in Kanto. They're far stronger than before. Let me show you how much, uh, crud. So, yeah, we're going to be battling uh, Homeboy right here. Zane, our other rival. And he's got himself Porygon 2. And it's at level 40 or 54. Okay, so... This wasn't a battle that I was looking forward to. But still, we're going to be battling. And, oh, uh, crap baskets. Okay, so fire type attacks do not work on this guy now. And it's increasing its attack. Ah, crud. Okay, so... Iron Tail. Let's go. And, uh, well, there's that recover. So, yeah, this guy has been... A, he's been a thorn in my ass for quite some time. And I don't know why I pressed that button again. And, well, just gonna keep on using recover. So let's go with the speed button. This guy is really pissing me off right now. Wow, okay, so this guy's just gonna recover every single time, so let's go. Let's go ahead and switch to Erwin right here and just destroy this guy. And he's coming out with a hyper beam, so let's go slash. Go again, and another hyper beam does it for the win. Cinder, let's go. Flame wheel, god dang it. Thunder punch. I keep on forgetting that it has uh, flare and all that stuff, so here we go. God dang it, this guy's just kicking my ass right now. All right, here we go. Sharpen again. Let's get it. Thunder Punch for the win, finally. Okay, so... Gonna use a Lapras. Ah, Jesus. Okay, so let's go Latios right here. And Luster Purge. Nearly does it. Not that strong. For Psychic. There you go. Now in Doom. And, well... Ah, crud, I don't have the Pokemon for him. So let's go with Houndoom right here, and let's use one of the Max re Revives. There we go, okay, so that guy's back. And Homie here can actually, I can switch out this guy right here, go back. Crunch attack, doesn't do much, but here we go with the Surf attack, eat that. And he's going to be now with the Victory Bell, so let's go straight to our good old buddy, Buttkiss. All right, overheat. Overheat is almost overkill, and he's coming out with an Ombreon. So let's go, Rat Baskets. Oh, let's go back to Erwin right here. Dragon Claw. And there's a Wish. God dang it! I really do hate Dark type Pokemon sometimes. And here we go, Slash Attack. Another Wish. Ice Punch. God dang it! Fuck you. Here we go. Toxic attack. Uh, this guy will not let me win that easily. Now I can't move. Or I can't leave. God dang it! Fucking freeze, you asshole! Okay. 
Luckily for us, we got full restores. Okay. Alright, go ahead. Okay, here we go. Oh, he's definitely making us... Oh, yeah, he's got a fuck... Come on! There we go. Suck it! Eat it! God damn, I hate you. God damn you, Zane. Yeah, I got you again, you asshole. Oh, my God. Even training my Pokemon in Kanto doesn't help. You have humiliated me for the last time, Draven. I'm becoming more evil towards you and the rest of the world. Just wait and see what happens next. Uh, okay, well, you, you say that, but you're going to get your ass kicked eventually. So, um, well, in the next episode, guys, we will be going through the Cycling Road. Hey, cycling Road headed straight to um, Fuchsia City. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next.